It's Moira Rose. <laughs> Please welcome the mustachioed Ted Lasso. From Bridgerton, please welcome Her Royal Highness, Queen Charlotte. From WandaVision, check out our very own Avenger, Wanda Maximoff. But he's oh. great at lugging bodies around. Give it up for the circle oh, yeah. Yeah. Regarding the story that we've been following about the deadly shooting on Alec Baldwin's movie, Russ. So the assistant director, who is responsible for overall safety on set, admitted he didn't properly check the revolver that Alec Baldwin fired. I've said from the very beginning, it's going to go from civil, which is just money. If it was just a mistake, that's different. This is egregious, gross negligence on many people's parts. I see criminal proceedings happening. A hiker who failed to check in at the end of the day while hiking Mount Elbert, right here in Colorado, was reported missing to authorities. Get this, the hiker declined their repeated phone calls, did not answer their texts, all because the calls came from an unknown number. Eric, I always call like our survivalist. Yeah, I'm a survivalist, but I'm an urban survivalist. Yeah. <laughs> She's not a hiker. Yeah, I don't, I don't go out into, y'all not going to catch me off the grid. Yeah. Okay. Some elementary schools in upstate New York are banning Squid Game Halloween costumes. Costumes like these are banned due to concerns about the potential violent nature of the game. We need to stop coddling everybody. That's what I need to think. Mm. We have video games where you could blow people's head off, chop them in half, but we say that doesn't affect children because it's a huge market, right? We have to we have to coddle everybody in America to say like, this is wrong and now maybe we should just take it off the market. That's not gonna change people's behaviors. They're still gonna act how they act. Two stars have been cast in the upcoming Barbie movie. Margot Robbie is set to play the plastic icon. Greta Gerwig, who directed Lady Bird and Little Woman, co-wrote the script. She's definitely she's progressive. I feel like she's going to have a new spin on Barbie and Ken because they, Barbie and Ken traditionally are so bored. Poor thing's never had a flat foot, never been able to relax nope. her calf, and never been able to put on a ballet So what if flat. she likes that? She doesn't. Okay. I, oh, she can't advocate for herself? Oh, really? She's to be on tiptoes 24-7? Maybe that's how she feels most comfortable. Why don't you let Barbie speak for herself instead of trying to speak over her? The CEO of Spank surprised her staff recently. Sarah Blakely celebrated selling a majority stake of her company for $1.2 billion by giving her staff two first-class tickets to anywhere in the world. Kudos to her, kudos to Spanx. I think that that's a valuable lesson that a lot of corporations could learn. If you show that you have your uh, employees' best interests and you want to see them do well and thrive, they will produce for you. So what would you do if you got in, onto your seat on a plane, saw this, you ready? A woman with her hair draped over the back of her seat. Who are you complaining to, the person or the steward? By the time we land, I'm gonna have a good four bundles. Because <laughs> it's getting cut. Would you and that's not? about 12 ounces of hair. I don't wear hair extensions anymore, but I know the value. For many folks, cooking is an enjoyable pastime, but a new survey reveals a shocking number of us have had pretty bad kitchen nightmares. I feel like you always post your cooking pictures. Yeah, I like to cook. Has this happened to you? Um, I've started some fires. Really? Yeah. How? Because there's fire. Yeah, but it's contained. This isn't the And I'm wearing loose stores. strings. It happened to be an apron. Wait, you what? caught on fire? Okay. What? <laughs> Are you hooked on gory shows like the latest Netflix hit Squid Game? Well, these are indicators that you might have a high morbid curiosity. I want to see people getting their their heads smashed in, but I don't want to see it after. Oh. <laughs> okay, that's it. A new study from the University of Michigan found that men are just as emotional as women. Ever since my kids were born, Jordan, my wife, will even tell you, he, I cry more than her. Like, there's a oh, commercial, yeah. like, Snuggle the Bear will come really on and rub his blanket. And I'm like, oh, man, it's so cute, Snuggles. Yeah. Like, I'll cry. Right. And she's, like, turned cold. She's like, get over it. And, 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 and I tell you, we switch roll.